Okay guys, so what I've just done was to go ahead and link this to my iPad. Um, I'm going to use this little shaky assistive touch device as my pin pointer. Um, I'm going to open the app. That's this purpose built movement. This is in correlation with greatpurpose.org and the blogs and the websites. Um, I'm going to get back to this little um, box here with the blue um, number in it. Uh, the first one that we'll look at is we'll see the uh, scrolling pictures. Um, only three of them. I can put three of them up at a time and I kind of like these themes so I'm keeping those. And next we have the opening credits. Um, if you've never seen this, it's kind of on my YouTube channel as well. Um, basically, tap once you see this box here, tap it, and it's actually a video. And as you can see, it plays. It takes a couple of seconds. Um, but yeah, as you can see, after you tap it, you know, give it a couple of seconds and it'll pull up. Some um, devices have a play button, so you know immediately to press play. But I've noticed iPad and iPhones uh, do not. The iOS devices do not. Next, we have the PBM background. Basically, that's just kind of telling you what this is and how I got started. Um, if you see any spell checks or grammatical errors, just email me and let me know. I don't mind being corrected. Um, I mean, I really don't, honestly. And this button here, of course, backs out, back always takes you home. Then we have the salvation package. And basically what that is, I was trying to figure out why I kept saying basically. Basically what that is, is kind of a, um, I wouldn't necessarily say study guide <laughs> so much as just a little ebook kind of of what salvation is. And when I was holding study groups, this is what I gave at the end of each one if they didn't have it so on and so forth and it just talks about salvation and those what if moments and bible verses is basically like a a packet and what I'm doing is I'm swiping it like a book uh, although my pointer is over here I'm actually swiping it from right to left um, to turn the page and then of course back left to right to turn it towards the front front uh oh I've exited out of the app So as it's loading back up, it's pretty relatively quick, not super fast, but relatively quick. It doesn't, I haven't had any issues with it crashing. Next up we have the PBM logo. And that again talks about the specifics of, you know, this logo here. Um, and what it means and, you know, why those things were specifically chosen. And so then, of course, we named that symbolic thinking. So, of course, we're going to go back. You see, I'm going to press back. Of course, we see the pearls in the background. Anybody who knows me knows for about the last three years, I think all I've worn is pearls. Every now and then, I put on owls, owl earrings or something like that. But I'm pretty much a pearl gal. Next up, we have the PBM color. So, of course, you just click in there. This is, well, this is actually a picture from my birthday um, that my coworkers threw for me. Uh, uh, the picture of the table decoration decorations. But I thought it was so beautiful. So, I, I felt it just was very colorful. So, I picked that one. It actually has no bearing on this information here. But this is what all of the colors are, uh, PBM's colors um, this is what it stands for and so you can read through that and now we're going to go back next up we have making a splash and if you I'm going to click in there if you 
go to the website directly just entering greatpurpose.org this is the first page you see um, and so you have of course a series of photos that you can go through this is where you click to go in the um, I'm sorry into the website and this is where if you're led to give then you know you give and Purpose Built Movement is not a free ministry tool as a matter of fact you know we do a lot so it costs you know pretty high so if you feel led to give uh, honestly 100% of the donations go directly back into PBM's ministry and effort so you don't have to worry about that um, now we're going to go back so from this I'm sorry let me go here first if you click these three lines here that will show you everything within this website these are all the pages that are within this website um, and if you're familiar with the website or even the app you know that a few of these pages are blog pages um, and so maybe one day I'll go through the website but I'm just going to go through the app today now of course we're going to go back and then we have the psalmist and I just thought that was a, a, a appropriate name for some of the things that I put on there um, being led to and this is the where the blogs are we have lost art of being um, yourself we have purpose folks purpose focus we have um, guest couch and uh, dear father or it's really father finding my father discovering my dad and so we're just going to go ahead and click into the lost art try that one first and I've actually if you've been in there lately I've kind of revised the look I finally figured out how to do it as a RSS feed so that it you know you're seeing the actual blogs themselves and at any point this is me scrolling down at any point you can click in the box and open up the blog and it'll go straight to the um, the pages or it goes straight to that post itself and so of course you see this was my latest one I think I wrote this 615 yeah so now we're gonna go back the same with I'm just gonna hit all these blogs real quick so the same with every the other three um, you see that RSV I mean RSV <laughs> RSS feed um, you just scroll down and have all the blogs I've ever written same as it was before just kind of a to me it's a little bit easier layout this is guest couch going back and this is finding my father discovering my dad as you can see it's been a minute since I've had a opportunity I'm not gonna say had an opportunity it's been a minute since I've written consistently um, and definitely getting back on that just working on some other things and go back really haven't edited anything yet going back now this is greatpurpose.org this is the website so of course we have this making a splash takes you to the very front of the website um, I'm going to show you again since we kind of it takes you to this area where you have to click into this or just click this and then it'll take you into the website to the front page um, where the bulk of the information begins I'm going to go back however greatpurpose.org when you click this it just it sidesteps that first page basically the introduction page and goes uh oh and if you see subscribe for weekly updates PBM updates um, that just added that and basically what I'll be doing is sending you blog posts of that week and um, every, every, you know topics that were discussed in the chat room and so not so not <laughs> and so forth um, we're gonna go ahead and exit out of that but this takes you to the 
the start of the website and gets into the bulk of the information and again these three lines here everyone's different like Androids and all that but for the most part you'll have that drop down menu and gives you access to everything that's on the website so we're going to go ahead and click that X there and click this back button here the top one next we have socially relevant and as you can see it's nobody but me um, but these are my social sites um, I have a couple more that I have not added yet but for the most part these are my social sites and for the most part um, excuse me all of them are the same uh, Twitter and this is Facebook I just didn't want to call it Facebook this is a uh, PBMs Facebook and this is Twitter um, of course this is access is this the YouTube channel so this is actually in a couple of spots but we'll get back to this because um, this has its own tab but I guess I just wanted to have it under here too that's kind of doubling up I might change that I don't know um, of course then we have Car Carla's Corner that is the podcast and the way it comes up is going to immediately start playing and you see of course the controls here you see okay, so the volume the level here I'm going to go ahead and stop it I don't know if that mute worked it didn't sound like it did <laughs> um, maybe it was delayed a minute so I stopped that but of course you can go here I don't really like this layout but this is the one I had if you click those three lines then you get a chance to see what the podcast was about I don't know what this GSGDG is um, that's what I don't like about it because I don't know what that coding is but right after that tells you what the podcast is about and so I'm going to go ahead and hit this button go back and we're going to go back up again. And here is um, Purpose Built Movement's YouTube channel. And I wanted that separately because if you know what I use my YouTube channel for, I use it for Word of View. Um, and so this is the same intro video that we had at the very beginning of the app. Uh, and this is, I'm actually pretty proud because I took a long time to do this banner. <laughs> It took a long time. You wouldn't think it did, but it did. Um, but it basically purpose built movement. You were not just created to be, you were created to do. Unmask um, who you were created to be. So I guess you, you know, kinda having a have an understanding of who you are who you are supposed to be in order for you to really understand what you need to do. Um, so I'm gonna use that back button, check that out. Um, one more thing I'm going to say about YouTube, let me see if I can get it to um, play. My videos are in HD, that high quality. Um, I'm pulling one up now. So, I had to press pause because both of us are going to be talking. If you see this little tool, I, I don't know what you would call it. Um, it is a toolbar, but I don't know what it would look like in between the CC and the um, making this bigger. Uh, you click it, and you see where it says quality. If you click, click down, then you can click the 720 HD, and that just makes the and you do that with anything um, because a lot of times it won't necessarily load in the HD version because it's easier and faster to load in the the other ver other versions I'm trying to get it to go down while I talk um, so yeah that's one of the hints if you see my videos or see anybody's videos and you're trying to figure out why just click this down arrow here and you can see it automa it comes up automatically as either 240 or 360 and then there's also I think a 480 um, those three are the low definition they don't show the picture too well and but it's quicker to load so that's usually what YouTube videos come up as 
Um, I haven't figured out how to make mine automatically come up in HD. I don't know. Um, but I'm still working on it. So if you see a video and you're like, ugh, it looks pretty, try doing the quality and then going to either 720 or um, 1080. So I'm going to go ahead. If you click this button, what it'll do is take you back within the web browser you're in. So because YouTube, the um, YouTube channel was put in under a web browser, the back button will only is only taking you back within the web browser. So everywhere you went within that web browser, because this website again was in a web browser, so everywhere you went, when you click this button, it's just going back within Purpose Built Movements web browser. Uh oh, I accidentally clicked my um. No, I didn't want to do that. So let me go back here. What happened was when I was trying to go back, I accidentally clicked this bar here. And if you click this, basically what this is doing is getting you connected to my social network. And you can follow me in this. When you click this, you can follow me. That's, how, that's what that's doing. It's giving you a way to follow me. So click that back button. And then, of course, we have Word of View Notes. Um, and I kind of do this in a way, it's a lot extra, a lot extra. It's a lot of extra work, but what it does is when I put up a video, a lot of times I'm just kind of talking and I'm not necessarily quoting um, verbatim a scripture. I'm just using a word. So I try to either come in and give a, a verse or you know give a mini teaching on what it is okay this is my iPad storage is almost full that's that didn't pop up because of the app it just popped up because I need to clear my storage on my iPad period okay so again you can see the RSS feed and you can see all of the word of views and click on any of them and you'll have the same effect I don't do it every time especially if I um, put a scripture in there but it is the you click this button and it'll take uh oh oh yeah what that was was I was using you version to put some of this information up and so I have to probably go back and revise it. And I stopped using Uversion because they changed their, um, how they posted notes. And so it disrupted how I posted notes. But anyway, that's Word of View. So these two go together. This is the video and this is kind of like a, a little nugget of what was talked about in the video and the verses. I need to get better at the Word of View notes. Um as far as being a little bit more detail this one is basically moments with pearl that's kind of like my vlogging personal life i mean i don't do much but hey um it is what it is Is it still? Oh, I'm sorry. What happened was I was trying to see if it was still recording. Um, yeah, so this is Moments with Pearl. And if you click on any of these, this is, you know, just some random moments. You may catch me chilling by my bed or out and about or making a Snapchat or something weird. Um, this was the last one I did was Soap Creek. So, this was in Atlanta. So, just basically some, I guess, behind the scenes footage of my life. It's maybe boring to some, but it's enjoyable to me. Here's housekeeping. Um, this is telling you about, you know, just making sure you rate, review, and share purpose built movement. Um, and just kind of some of the things that you'll see. This talks about what this little blue line here means and so 
when you click that you'll see an area that says share now or rate and I want you to do both please and thank you and then if you saw that blue line what that means is a notification came through that you haven't checked and that's what it is I clicked here and then this popped up and all you have to do is press OK after you read it um, you can go back I think it shows the last five um, and so you can see the last few times what the push notica notification was so you go back and this right here uh oh no I don't want that up there um, creating a profile that was needed when I had another component to the app but I don't have that anymore I don't think I want that anymore so you don't have to make a profile here is prayer request um, as stated I pray for these daily and I fast and pray over them you know fast weekly for them and believe in God with you um, just type your request in here you don't have to send an email and press submit and it emails it to me I have no clue who you are unless you tell me um, but that was just a, a area that I wanted to give the opportunity for you to you know get somebody to be praying with you to God you know about the anything that you may be facing or you have a question about here is the tentative calendar and I had to change it like that this is what I mean is this is what uh oh this is how I want things or how I prayed about it and how the how I want it to be released so you see Saturday Sunday Monday these are the things that you know you have the blogs that are being um, released and around what time um, you have the podcast you have all this information the PBM daily nuggets I actually need to change that to pearls because I've changed it to PBM pearls you have verses and so basically that's just a calendar of if you're trying to figure out well how often do I write or when is such and such supposed to come out this is the schedule that I'm supposed to be following <laughs> and it keeps me accountable to you know the word I put out there and you know as you know or you may see in the video I'm going to drop tonight I'm talking about this schedule because <laughs> I have not been as diligent with this schedule um, just looking at Saturday I should have dropped I say dropped if you click it you see a um, it's actually a time frame so from 4.45 to 6 a.m. you know you can be expecting a daily PBM nugget and I think this is from yeah 5 to 8 you can be expecting a verse to be released um, and I could be today is Saturday June 18th I'm recording this on Saturday June 18th and I can tell you right now that neither one of this were done yet um, and I'm actually finna get ready to do them so it just kinda keeps me accountable to get back on track and that way it works as a spirit of excellence to keep you guys you know um, aware of what's going on so definitely I have to get back to that but that's why I called it tentative um, because you know I knew that there would, might be situations where I don't get things done and I didn't want to make this a you know just a, a fact I really just wanted it to be a, a level of accountability um, this section here PBM rapid fire um, I'm really excited about this section okay we know I'm really excited about this section. I haven't been on it in a, in a minute. That's that's sad. It opens up in a brand new uh, web browser, um, and the reason why is because of some of the things that are in here. Um, as you can see, it's been 17 days ago, and I can believe it because if I remember the last time I used it was. Um, before um, my vacation so I created it right before my vacation vacation and wrote in it and then went on vacation and just kinda got thrown off schedule but basically just clicking in it and 
you can kind of write something in it. Um, why so serious? These are just random moments. You can see something. Let's see. I clicked on Snapchat fun and random pictures. And here you can reply. Um, you can reply as a, you can log in or you can reply as an unregistered user. And you don't have to do anything except type in your reply and hit send. Um, let's see. So that's pretty much it about that. The only thing I don't like about it is, of course, it takes you out of the app. And so you have to kind of get back in the app. Um, that's why I saved it for last. You can either... I, I don't know I yeah yeah I didn't want it in app I did have it there but for iPad users or iOS iOS users it wasn't pulling up oh I keep clicking it and getting out of it and clicking it um, it was not pulling up links and uh, wasn't allowing you to place links and put in certain pictures so it was really restrictive under the iOS which is iPhone, Apple um, devices. So until they change that, I'm going to have to have it a, um, a browser with it. If I click that one more time, <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to, I want to keep it as a, you know, separate browser or open it in a new browser um, instead of doing something like this, which this is a web browser as well, but it opens within the app. because it's still you don't see that um, getting out of the app and going into a new browser you can still hit that back button but once you click in here you have to physically go back into the app um, so that's basically an overview I don't hope I didn't say um too much and I hope I didn't sound too um, <laughs> hope I didn't sound too um, boring but I just kind of wanted to give an overview of what the app was and what I was doing. I thank you guys for subscribing. I've had a few new subscribers over the last couple of weeks. Um, it's kind of been exciting. Uh, even to the YouTube page. So I thank you guys. I mean, it means much to me. That means that, you know, you're listening and appreciating what God has given me to share with you all or share with the world and you appreciate that so i thank you for that um and that's basically it so just remember go to the app store um i just clicked it again go to the app store anyone if you have i've done it on android i don't really feel like going through um to do an android video but if i need to I will. Um, yeah, game seven. If you type in, of course, everybody's talking about purpose. I gotta learn how to spell it first. <clears throat> purpose built movement. I'm pretty sure you can type in just purpose built, but it's a lot of purpose built. Um, It'll kind of take you somewhere if you just be direct. You'll you'll see it pop up, and that's both in Android and Amazon. Um, as you can see, I have some updates I need to do. So just go out and get the app. As you can see, for some strange reason, it's making me put it under as um as a business. I don't know. Uh, I have no clue why, but it's not. Um, that was the closest I didn't even have like an information option or you know blog or anything like that it just yeah <laughs> so and then let's see let's see version history so I guess I only have one version maybe when the um, software gets updated they'll update that version and of course here's where you write a review and let me know how you feel uh, and so that's all I think I'm going to go ahead and cut this video short and probably post it under um, either Moments with Pearl probably both Moments with Pearl and uh, Real Talk 
So thank you guys.